Bonadan Shemai, I am Lord Welshie, and welcome back to Medieval 2 Total War, The Rise of the Welsh Empire. In the last episode, we took Nottingham, which was the last bastion of the old English order. Uh, the English were removed from the game as a faction. However, the Barons' Alliance then became England, uh, and now my only ally uh, in the British Isles has turned against me. It will be an and their king is out you. in the middle yes, no of sire. nowhere. I, uh, no sire. one can get to him. Can no your no one can sire. get to him. Otherwise, I'd be very tempted to uh, send a couple of units after him. But I've got no one that can get to uh, get to him in time. Anyway, so uh, we just have the Barons Alliance and the Scots to deal with now on mainland Britain. As you can see, I've still got a long way to go. I've got to push north. Uh, and just try and deal with the Scots, try and take them out of the game if I can, but I want to take their capital. Uh, I have got Castletown over on uh, the Isle of Man over here. Let's condense them down a bit. There we go. So that looks a bit better. So I've got a fairly decent garrison sat inside Castletown now. Do you know what? Let's uh, get you building stuff while I've got some money from when I sacked Nottingham. Now, um, one plan I did potentially have was to build a fleet uh, sort of from Norwich and just sail them north uh, with a large army, land on the tip of the nose of Scotland, right around here where these trees are, uh, and just try and move in from there. That'll force the Scots to uh, pull some of their armies back from their southern borders, and it gives me the opportunity to strengthen my northern borders uh, along here, uh, near Lincoln and uh, Lancaster, ready to push north and invade. So I might actually go ahead and do that. Uh, we will go with, what's better, cogs or hulks? Hulks. So we'll get a, get a few of those on the go, get some retraining. Billmen, yes, why not? Should I bother with archers? We'll get a bombard on the go as well. Cool. Now then. It's time to build more of my armies ready to push north, so we'll do that. Again, another thing I was thinking of doing is uh, using this fleet and going up the western coast to try and take some parts of Scotland. Because if I could take this island up here, um, I'm just wondering if that would make a good base of operations. However, if it is under Scottish rule and I take it, I'm afraid... I'll end up with uh, some rebelling going on, which I don't want to happen right at the minute. I don't know if I could deal with any of my settlements rebelling. Okay, that looks good. So Nottingham's in a good place. Uh, <laughs> in terms of military force, Norwich, again, fairly happy with the garrison there. So my northern borders, Chester. Chester's got a very good garrison. Actually, let's shrink you down a bit. Uh, let's see. Yeah, Chester's looking good. Um, I can't really train anything useful in Chester at the minute, which is a little bit annoying. So I need to start building some more military manufacturing uh, facilities. But next turn. No one assaulted me. That's good. Oh, and there's this whole thing still going. Mercantile acquisition. There was lucrative trade to be had here, but first we must deal with the opposition. The guild recommends you send your merchant to make an acquisition of this merchant's trade. This chap? Uh, okay. Well, I will manufacture a merchant. Get rid of all these. There we go. Now then, how's the fleet looking? Aye, sire. Okay, so we've got a couple more uh, units being built there. That's fine. Right. Get some manufacturing on the go. Yeah, boy. Uh, <laughs> let's see. Oh, I've got gun hulks I can make here. Huh. Well, I won't worry too much about that right now. Uh, you've got very high tax rates. So you're looking okay. What do you advise I build? 
She's telling me nothing. I'll go with irrigation. Nottingham, can you manufacture some additional units? I don't think you can at the minute. That's fine. Oxford, how about you? Ooh! Uh, you can have a militia drill square, because why not? And get some units retrained. I'm running out of money again. Not necessarily a good thing, but fine. Whatever. Uh, so Lincoln is really going to be the next target, I suppose. Let's see now. The Great Drowning of Men, an incredible southwesterly Atlantic gale like never seen before, has struck the northwestern tip of Europe, lashing England right across to Denmark. Unstoppable tor storm tides have swept inland, killing many, and the conditions at sea are dire enough to make sailing for the brave and foolhardy only. Ooh, so does this mean I shouldn't send my... Uh... Ships ready! Yes, my lord. Yeah, it's a clear victory, boyos. Ha-ha! Oh, they've landed an army on... Um... How did I not notice that? I'm only here to fight the Yugaloot. Oh, who are you, feudal knights? Right, can you recruit? Do you need to recruit? Retrain. Uh, why don't we get one more unit? We've got a couple of units of archers. That's fine with me. Yeah, that should be good. Uh, right, what's my next move? Can you reach the boat yet? Not quite. Boarding transport, sire. Nottingham's fine. Chester's fine. They're into I'm my territory now. And I don't have an army to intercept. Hmm. Why don't we try hiring an assassin? Retrade everyone! Right. Let's see what the Scots do now. Still nothing. Oh, they're going for Nottingham! Okay. Uh, train, train, train. Retrain you as well. That could be hairy. They've just wandered right through my territories. That's concerning. Uh, let's get you building... Okay. Yeah, the army in here might not be enough to... Soon enough, oh, boy. Orders. They're joining the fleet, sire. A fine day How far north can we go? <laughs> right, invasion forces moving no northwards. Today, um, can I send reinforcements to Nottingham? Uh, this might be a good idea, but I don't think I've got any units that are actually capable of getting there. But the, the worry is... If I do send units to Nottingham, he could quite easily just walk around the outside of the city. Okay, well, next turn. That's uh, really all we can do at this point. Oh, I'm surprised we're not under siege. That's probably because he was waiting for his second army to get there. Right, well, while we're waiting for that... There we go. So get rid of those. Right! Ships Invasion fight. force, continue north. Newcastle upon Tyne, you have got nothing. Quit that, you damn schooner. Okay. Okay, do I keep going or do I take Newcastle and use that as a base to. I haven't gone as far north as I wanted, is, uh, is the main point of contention there, I think. Uh, let's build a heavy armourer. Can't really recruit anything from you. You've just got billmen. And I don't want to risk losing them. Shrewsbury, you've not got much. I have an assassin here. You want dead? Now give it a go. Get in range and give it a go. Death give it a, a wee bash there. Ship's right. Ready. Fleet. Uh, go kill that fleet. Yes, my lord. Victory! Play that fleet as well. Defeat. Well, it was worth a shot. Go get that fleet. He can't run away. Wait, how was I defeated? 
fleet ready, sire. Scotland will fight ye for these waters. I would like to take Lincoln at some point, but that's uh, and your posts. The enemy defeated. Yeah. Sire, the enemy defeated. That's unfortunate. Uh. Well, we're still not under siege. Sire. Okay. Uh, should I get rid of a weaker unit of archers? Train new. Retrain new. But that would leave me with one unit of archers. But 18 archers won't do a lot. I'd rather have you in there. Yes, sire. Sweet! Right. Uh, invasion force. Ships ready. Quit that, you damn schooner. <sighs> do I keep going north or do I take Newcastle? Newcastle has very little in there to stop me. It's got next to nothing that could prevent me from attacking. Let's go yes, north. Sir. Full sail. We can go no further this day, sire. Aye, sire. Okay, so you're up in the north. I need to remember that you're there. Uh, Carnarvon, you're doing okay, I think. Pembroke, you're fine. Right, uh, let's focus on getting some armies down here ready, shall we? Because I'm still very concerned about those Scots. Hmm, Oxford, you can't really do much in the way of recruitment. Gloucester, you can, that's fine. London, just the one unit, that's fine, okay. You gonna give it a go? Missed. Missed the target. Because you got slammed in the face by a door! Uh, how about just name go for it? Target, Give it a try. Did you get him? Oh, nice work. Who do you want dead? Well done. Okay, Northern Invasion Force, go. Oh, Aberdeen. Aberdeen will do. Ships ready. Soon enough, I'll place your head atop. Aye, sire. We. Yes, sir. Full okay, maybe not. No oh, they did have a. Side. Damn it, I didn't see it. Right, the invasion forces in the north. Side. Nottingham is still surrounded. Fantastic, great, wonderful, marvelous. Are we gonna have a fight at some point in this uh, in this game? Because really, you guys are just kind of hanging around and kind of annoying me at the minute. <laughs> I want to kind of fight you. I mean, is that so much to ask? Uh, we'll get another unit of you. Another unit of archers. That should be decent enough. Oh boy. Uh, right, can I do anything over here? Not mm, possibly. Retrain a couple of units, why not? Let's get your tax rate up a bit. Get more money on the f on the flow. London! You can still do nothing. You're useless, London. Uh... Scotland, you're still just hanging around. They want me to take Lincoln. I mean, Need I can do that, I suppose. Try Name it. Thy target. Give it a go. Oh, slammed in the face. And stabbed himself. <sighs> you bloody useless assassin. Okay. So... The main question is now, do I send 
a force to take Lincoln. Because what's Lincoln got? Absolutely sod all. Uh, I don't think I even need the... I don't even need those. Just get a unit of archers in there. Right. Uh, we will send... Orders. Three units of billmen. Will, three units of heavy billmen. And one unit of Gwent Raiders. I suspect that will be enough. Still Nottingham! Convert to city. No, I'm keeping you as a tough as nails sort of castle. Right, invasion force to the north. Orders. Go for it. War, then, sire. Uh, to assault the walls. We lay they siege. could. I'm assaulting them now. Let's do this. I shall lead our forces into battle, my Okay, lord. we're finally into a fight. We're going to take Aberdeen. I cannot see how I could lose this fight. And now that I've said that, I probably will. That'd be awkward, wouldn't it? Now, if I can take Aberdeen, repair the walls, and just hold it, uh, that would make a fantastic sort of staging ground for uh, battles in Scotland. It'd be a good place to... Remember that make my start. Let me see now. Yes, this should be good. Okay. Uh, what we'll do, we will just go for the gates. Wait, have they got ballista towers? Because that would suck if they did. Right. Let's get those gates knocked down. So we'll just put a hole through the gates. They haven't got anyone, as far as I can see, based on the map in the bottom corner. Um, okay, they're all at the town square and they're on their way. But it's two units of ballista and one unit of militia, I think. So I should be able to handle that quite easily. Gates down? There we go. Right. Uh, three units of spears should be adequate. Uh, one, two, three. And just run it. Because, you know, why not? Right. This is uh, hopefully going to be one of the easiest sieges I'll have dealt with. I've got them running straight away. They are fresh. They've been these units have been upgraded with armor, which is good, so they look nice and shiny. Good, good looking, good looking there, guys. Oh, looking good there. Good looking. Hey, good looking. What you got cooking? I I I apologize. There's uh, there's just no reason for that. Anyway, spearmen on the go. Look how fantastic they look. So shiny. So good, much red and green, as there should be with anything Welsh. Ah, it's archers. Archers and ballista. I can deal with this. The gates are ours. The Lord is there. We go. We've what have they got down the there? Is that... Walls. Oh, they've got uh, a unit of horses. Of cavalry. I don't know what unit of cavalry they've got. But I'm still confident that my three units of... Uh... Ooh, bombard. Still confident my three units of spears should be enough to win the day. But just in case... Back up. Come on, can we catch them? Catch them! They're slow, they're pushing a bombard. So what have we got? We've got bombard, we've got archers, we've got general's bodyguard. I'm thinking of a completely different settlement when I checked the, uh, the map for some reason. When I checked what units they had. But I'm not too worried. I still am fairly confident. Are we going to hit? 
Bam! <laughs> Slightly anticlimactic, isn't it? Where they just run in going, ah! Okay, Bombard unit is running. Spears run to position. Because I'm just waiting for their cavalry to try and counter charge. Ah, and there go the archers. Right. Get in position quickly. Uh, let me think, let me think, let me think. You by all means go over there. Run it. Get the charge. Let's make this super messy. I don't want them to get too many more shots off than they need to, uh, than they can. How's this going to look? Hit. Bam. And in we go. Second unit. Okay, third unit. That's your target. How are we doing? I'm losing men. But I suppose it's because I'm fighting the general's bodyguard and uh, the bombard. Men are winning the, battle. the bombard's one of the like toughest this, units to fight in combat, them. clearly. Oh, hello! Do you know what? Let's uh, just charge now that you're kind of in place. There we go. They're pinned. We've got them surrounded on all sides. Our men are in command of the city. Wow, uh, one of my units is down to 46. That's uh, that's not Only good. Only half the enemy force remains. I'm surprised they have that much left. I've lost 5% of my men. That's fine. Joe's bodyguard is down to 5. Come on, we got this. We got this. Let's have a look how he does. The uh, the general there. Come on, we can get him. It's just him on his own. Turn around and stab him. There he goes. There he goes. I think victory is essentially guaranteed at this point. There are two bombard. No, sorry, two archers left. Uh, zero archers. Victory is ours. Excellent. And I didn't lose that many men. One unit down to... Still just over half strength. I lost 46 men. I am fine with that. 46 is not a bad number to have taken Aberdeen. And I've got a sizable garrison in there. So I should be able to weather any major attacks that the Scots can... Uh, sort of swing my way in retaliation. Now, I've just got to hope that I don't get any riots that kick me out. Such is the fate of all who oppose us. The settlement sweet, has sweet fallen. victory. Take right. The Drop the tax war. rate down. Uh, da -da 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 -da. Let me see. Insurgents, not happy. Distance to capital and squalor. So, tavern to make you happy. And we'll upgrade the ballista towers, we'll repair the wall, and oh, I'm going to be able to recruit some uh, lovely Scots, uh, Scottish ready, units before long, get from the looks fired. of it. Preparing to board and engage the enemy. Where did you get? There you are. Is ours, Scotland will fight ye for these waters. Okay, Aberdeen is taken. Outstanding. Uh, I think that's a good place to end this episode. Um, there was just the one fight. Obviously, I spent a lot of time with my setup. Um, I've still got Lincoln to take as my next mission. Lincoln Lincoln is the one I was thinking of that only has the town militia and then two units of ballista, so I'm quite happy that my bill men and my Gwent Raiders should be able to take it. Nottingham, surrounded by the Scots, but they don't seem that fussed with doing anything, probably because I've got quite a strong garrison. If they do attack, I should be able to hold... Hopefully. But we will find out in the next episode what is going on. Anyway, thank you guys so much for joining me on this one. If you liked it, hit that like button down below. And as always, I will catch you in the next video. Bye, Zs!